Hello, good evening to you. And part of the story here is the Albaid Stadium by night. 60,000 capacity here. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And the group stage action has been pulsating up to this point. This is the final game of the group for these two sets of players. It's Japan, and they take on Spain. Cheers, Derek. Well, it's been a tough group for them, and unfortunately, they haven't played with enough quality. Let's hope we see them play better today, especially for these fans. And here's the starting 11 for Japan. Well, in this shape, their two holding midfield players will be key today. If they can get on the ball and dictate the play, protect the two centre-backs, it will then allow the attacking players to show their creative quality. Here's the lineup for Spain. Carvajal starts with Jordi Alba in the fullback positions. Coque starts with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. And the main striker today is Morata. And now they get the ball rolling. And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. Pedri. Now Busquets. A very timely interception. Well, that pass easy on the eye well not to be he had moved into an illegal position well it's great that he wants to run in behind but he has to get the timing right well, the referee took note of the earlier incident and now issues the yellow card Sergio Busquets. Here's Carvajal. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Minamino. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Magnificent defending. Now can they make something happen? Takes on the shots! Well, we gave it the big build-up, but he didn't quite deliver on his promise. Morata. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Must take the lead here. And they have, you've got to say, it has been coming. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. Go! 
are back underway and 1-0 it is let's see what happens next Sergio Busquets gives it a go. It could have been awkward for the goalkeeper. <laughs> Playing it in, and a struggle to get it away properly. Morata, Koke, able to get his body in the way. How can he take them on and beat them? But they dealt with the threat posed. Morata. So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. Can he convert? Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Let's see about the delivery. And the danger's still on. Can he find the net? Determined defending. That is that for the first half here. Well, oh, marvellous stuff from Morata, you've got to say, in the first 45. What did you make of his performance? Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the play. Well, underway once more and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Sarabia and a goal kick is the outcome but well, attacking possibilities chance to finish and there it is a two goal cushion now and they just need to keep the concentration Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And the finish from Torres gives the keeper no chance. He hits it with such venom. underway with the lead standing at 2-0 Morata Morata and a goal wonderful stuff as they accelerate away from the opposition Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And Morata does the rest. He strikes it so cleanly, there's no stopping that one. Goal! 
Is this going to be a thrashing? 3-0 now. Clattered away. He's driven in the corner. Well, using his body to good effect. Nicely timed tackle. Well, there it is, as expected. Spain have controlled most of the ball so far, and they've made... Hang on a minute, Stuart. Opportunity unfolding. Oh, a goal! How about that? He's put it away to make it a hat-trick. Well, when you see this again, I think the goalkeeper's very unlucky. He makes a good initial save, but the ball comes off of him, rebounds straight to an attacker, and the finish is excellent. A lopsided contest, 4-0. And he's made headway, and in! Oh yes, exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4-1. Nagatomo. It's with Asano. Daichi Kamada. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Torres. Just 10 minutes remaining here. And providing width. Textbook defending inside the box. Ferran Torres. Well, possession lost by Spain. Morata. And good pressure high up the pitch. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. And they're making a change. Trying to pick out a teammate. No trouble at all as far as the keeper was concerned. Mina Mino. And a good looking ball. And just has to remain calm. Can someone latch on to it? And the penalty has been given here. Well, he gave the referee a big decision to make, Stuart. And I think the referee got that right. He had to go there. The keeper going in the right direction and saving it. And it's over now. A win for Spain. It has gone according to their master plan. Stuart, what have you made of their performance? 
You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent, full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance.